Great. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the Divine Mercy for America Holy Hour Novena. Uh, it is October 6th, 2021. We are Dave and Joan Maroney. You can find us at uh, divinemercyforamerica.org. Click on the membership tab and sign up for all of the wonderful email groups. And we are blessed today to have our longtime friend, I don't want to call him old, but our longtime friend, Father Jim Kelleher from the Society of Our Lady of the Most Holy Trinity, located in beautiful Corpus Christi, Texas. And we've invited Father to share. He is the founder of Global Living Rosary and now the Miraculous Medal program that Father, we thought would be great to, to share with everybody. So without further yeah. ado, we're going to ask you to do a quick prayer and okay. uh, speak to us. All right. So let's uh let's pray the memorari in the name of the father and the son and the holy spirit amen remember O most gracious virgin mary that never was it known that anyone who fled to thy protection implored thy help or sought thy intercession was left unaided inspired by this confidence we fly unto thee O virgin of virgins our mother to thee do we come before thee we stand sinful and sorrowful O Mother of the Word incarnate, despise not our petitions, but in thy mercy. Hear and answer us. Amen. Okay, so I want to uh, thank you, Joan and uh, Dave, for inviting me today. I want to put you all to work, okay? So I, I hope that you, how many of you have your cell phones with you? Okay, so what I'd like you to do is go to your cell phone, go to Google. I'm taking you through these steps. It's very quick. I'm sort of a fast guy in general so you go to google you do you put it type into your search engine knights of the miraculous metal knights of the miraculous metal just type that in to the search engine and click on it okay That's like with the k right right knights of the miraculous metal with a k when you click on that you're going to see some gold and silver miraculous metals but just scroll down to the first entry which says knights of the miraculous metal and click on that because that's going to take you to the home page, which I developed um, recently. And uh, just a second here. Well, we can show. Okay, so, on the so is everybody on the home page where you can see? Let, why uh, we, why, we'll just we'll just do it. Let him. Okay, but not yeah, just, just let if people go to their home page. Now, I'm going to walk you through how to become a member of this to be a Knight of the Miraculous Medal or a Lady Knight of the Miraculous Medal. It's really simple. And you know, if you wanna do it, you can. If you don't wanna do it, you don't need to, but I'm gonna go through it as if some or all of you are gonna do it because this can be a game changer for you because this can make you a more powerful evangelizer on our ladies team it can give you an opportunity to help a lot of people in a very simple way. And it's, it's not gonna take a lot of your time. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to pray the consecration prayer. So scroll down to just below the, the picture of me without a beard with a young lady there. It says an act of consecration to Our Lady of the Miraculous Medals. So we're going to pray that together right now. O Virgin Mother of God, Mary Immaculate, we dedicate and consecrate ourselves to you under the title of Our Lady of the Miraculous Medal. May this medal be for each one of us a sure sign of your affection for us and a constant reminder of our duties towards you. While we're, ever while wearing it, may we be blessed by your loving protection and preserved in the grace of your son. O most powerful Virgin Mother of our Savior, keep us close to you. Every moment of our lives, obtain for us your children the grace of a happy death so that in union with you, we may enjoy the bliss of heaven forever. Amen. And then we pray three times. O Mary, conceive without sin, pray for us who have recourse to thee. O Mary, conceive without sin, pray for us who have recourse to thee. O Mary, conceive without sin, pray for us who have recourse to thee. Now we're going to scroll back up to the top of the page. Yeah, right there, Dave, that's perfect. That's perfect. The second thing to become a knight or a lady of the miraculous medal is you wear your miraculous medal every day. I'm wearing mine right now under my shirt. And the second, third thing you do is you distribute the miraculous medal in your spheres of influence to your family members, your friends, people you work with, just people that God sends to you daily. 
the God and the Virgin Mary want these people blessed and you can be part of their blessing by giving them a miraculous medal. And then the fourth thing you agree to is here it says pray one decade of scripture rosary joyful mystery every day. But all you have to agree to is just to pray one decade of the rosary a day. It doesn't have to be scripture rosary. It doesn't have to be joyful mysteries. I just put that there. So if you want to pray the scripture rosary, if you want to play, pray joyful mysteries, you know how to get to it. Okay. And then the fifth thing you do to complete your registration is you send your name, address, and phone number and email to. There's two emails there. I'd like to request you to send it to the second email, which is padrejmk at yahoo.com, because that will come to me most quickly. The other one, I have to go into a website and retrieve it. But on this one, it'll come to me directly. So send your uh, registration to padrejmk at yahoo.com. Okay. And all you have to do is click on that, web, that address and it will um, pop up a you sending me an email and you just fill in the email. You just put your, you, at the top of the email, you put Knights of the Miraculous Medal. Then you put your name, your address, your phone number and email, and then just click send. So uh, David, Joan, are they able to respond at all? Have, have some of them been able to complete it? I don't know if they have, they can unmute and uh, okay. share with us. Yeah. Are are any of them unmuted? Or Has anybody been able? A lot of them are on their computers now, or on their phones, or I iPads. put the uh, the website link in the chat if you so you okay you can go to the chat and get that. okay. Um, so has is there are they interacting with us at all or? Yes, I mean they uh, they're hearing us, you, but yes. what do they have to do to talk like? <laughs> Mary Jane, Christine, were you able to do this? I I'm just working did. I have a miraculous medal around my neck. Okay. So, okay, you're into it. So now that, are you ready to go to the next step? Because this is important to be. I don't have a phone. So whatever you have online is good for me. Okay. Okay. I, so, just, I have an old phone. <laughs> all right. No problem. But see, go below my uh, email address, padrejmk at yahoo.com where it says to obtain miraculous metals uh, to distribute, click here. Let's click, click. on the, Click on that link, amm.org. Okay. This we're may gonna... seem pedestrian what I'm doing, but if you master this, you're going to become a big distributor on the Virgin Mary's team, and uh, you're going to help a lot of people. So here, gonna... here's where okay, they... Okay, so on this page, you want to click on the... You want to go to the left hand side, count down three, one, two, three. There's a silver miraculous medal there. Click on that silver miraculous medal. It says it costs 13 cents. Mm -hmm. If you click on that, now it's going to open you up to a page where you can actually order the medal. Just for fun, I want you to put in the quantity section the 100. Type 100 in there. It's happening. Okay. So Card. Now you've ordered a hundred miraculous medals are going to cost you eight cents a piece. So Dave, if you can click, click on add to chart. Okay. You see how it shows you 100 medals, $8. And now go to checkout, Dave. Yeah, okay. And so now on this page, you fill out what well, says uh, check out as guests. Click check out as guest, Dave, because that's the easiest way to do this. So you don't have to go through a bunch of rigmarole. Is it going to open? It's, it's taking, yeah. Yeah, OK. OK, so now, now you fill out all your information, you know, uh, your credit card information and then the shipping information where you want it shipped to. So at this point, you know how to do everything. You be If you've sent me your email with your name, phone number, email address, and uh, home address, at least the city and state you live in, then you're a knight or a lady of the rack, this medal. You know how to order medals. Now, what's cool about this is these 100 miraculous medals will come to your door within a week. They're not going to charge you any shipping. So you get these 100 medals for $8. They come to your door. And not only is there no shipping, but they're already blessed when they arrive at your door because they blessed them at their shrine before they sent them. Okay. Mm -hmm. So why is this so important that I took you through these steps? 
Well, I've shown you how anybody who has access to a computer like we just had there, they can order a hundred, a thousand, however many miraculous medals they want. Because being a knight or lady of the miraculous medal, the key is giving away the medal. That's the key to give away the medal. Now, why is it very valuable to give away this medal? Well, we have to remember what the Virgin Mary said to St. Catherine. When she appeared to St. Catherine, November 27th, 1830, what did she say? She said, have a medal made that looks like this. Those who wear it with faith will receive many graces. So, of course, St. Catherine had the medal made, right? Well, what happened? Many people in Paris started wearing the medal. They asked the, uh, this is a very important that uses this kind of wording. They asked the Virgin Mary to pray with them directly to Jesus. There were so many miracles and conversions in Paris that the people gave the medal a nickname. What nickname did they give it? The Miraculous Medal, right? That's a nickname. The official name of the medal is the Medal of Our Lady of the Immaculate Conception. And that's why written around the outside of the medal is the little prayer, O Mary, conceive without sin, pray for us who have recourse to thee. Now, I hope all of you are already wearing a miraculous medal, but when the Virgin Mary appeared to St. Catherine, she had rings on her finger. And some rings, uh, you know, they were precious jewels. Some of the jewels were lit up and rays of light were emanating from them. Other jewels weren't. When St. Catherine asked her about the ones that weren't lit up, the Virgin Mary said, well, those are, th those are graces that I haven't given yet because no one's asked for them. So you see, it's very important that even today, you think of something that you're working on in your life. It can be anything. But right now, you ask Our Lady under her title of the Miraculous Medal to intercede for you for a resolution to that challenge or problem or whatever you need help with. And then pray silently right now to yourself the prayer. I'll pray it out loud. But, O oh Mary, conceive without sin. Pray for us who have recourse to thee. Now, I've been giving miraculous medals away for 30 years. I learned how to do this when I was a graduate student in Rome. I learned how to do it by reading the Colby Reader and reading how St. Maximilian Colby's rector of the seminary where Colby was studying one day told them the story of the miraculous conversion of Alphonse Radisbon, the wealthy Jewish banker from Paris, France, who was engaged to a very beautiful woman. The bottom line of the story is this. Alphonse Radisbon went to Italy to a very Catholic friend of his. When he got in the friend's house, he saw this religious artwork. He made fun of it. The friend said to him, OK, Alphonse, we're going to have an experiment. You wear this miraculous medal for a week. If nothing happens to you, you win the experiment. If something happens to you, I win. Uh, Alphonse was re reticent, but he accepted the experiment. Well, what happened was, and then the, his friend told him to pray the memorari every day. But when Alphonse went home that night to the hotel, he just mumbled the memorari as he went to sleep. The next morning, he woke up and the memorari would not stop repeating in his mind. One or two days later, he saw that Italian friend of his on the street of Rome. They went to a parish church because the Italian friend had to make funeral arrangements for someone who had died. While Alphonse is in the chapel uh, looking around, suddenly a beam of light comes from the ceiling, drives him to his knees. When his Italian friend comes back to the chapel, Alphonse is there crying and kneeling. And the friend said to him, what are you doing, Alphonse? And Alphonse says, take me to a Catholic priest. And his friend says, what do you mean? And Alphonse says, take me to a priest and take me now. So the friend takes him down the street to the Jesuit church. The Jesuit comes out and says, how can I help you? Alphonse says, I want to be baptized right now. And uh, the Jesuit says to the Italian, has he had his instructions? And the Italian says, no, he's an agnostic Jew. And, uh, but Alphonse says, well, I know the answers to all the questions. And so the Jesuit questions him on the Catholic faith. Alphonse has all the answers right. And the Jesuit goes, what's going on here? And Alphonse says, well, the Virgin Mary appeared to me. She taught me everything. And she also showed me where I was going if I didn't change my life. So he wanted to be baptized and he got baptized. That's a very famous conversion story. And when Colby heard that story from his rector, a light went on and Colby began to distribute the miraculous medal. And he actually formed a group to distribute the miraculous medal. 
Now I'm a member of his group, but as I'm not a Franciscan, so I can't go and you know super promote his group. So I just invented my own group, which is very similar. And so I've had this website for about six months. Uh, we have over 75 members. Most of them I personally recruited. Most of them I've walked through how to, you know, buy medals off the website, how to distribute them. That there's a video underneath the requirements there where I am without my beard. And in five minutes, I show you different ways to give the medal to people. I give this medal to, you know, I give it to Catholics that are practicing. I give it to Catholics that aren't practicing. I give it to Protestants, Jews, Muslims. I give it to agnostics. I give it to atheists. And as a matter of fact, I even give it to politicians. <laughs> so anyway, if it works. Yeah, you, you. All I can tell you is that in 30 years of giving this medal out, one of the big projects that I, our Lord and Our Lady, got me involved in was building a world-class chapel of perpetual adoration, built in the shape of a cross with a 75-foot blue dome with gold stars, uh, representing Our Lady of Guadalupe, uh, who's the star of the new evangelization. It was Spanish colonial architecture, and it holds 250 people. Well, the Holy Spirit put that vision in my heart. I just happened to share it with a few people. Well, one day a guy called me up, who, who I'd given a miraculous medal to three months before, and asked me what I was doing. I told him, he said, you're doing anything else? I gave him the vision for the chapel. The bottom line is that guy flew me to Mother Angelica's church. And on that weekend, he said to me, as we were walking back to where we were staying, he said, Father, you know that chapel you want to build? I said, yeah. He says, that's from God. I said, it is? He says, yeah. And God's given me the means to pay for the entire architectural work for your chapel. I said, you really? He says, yeah, and I'm going to do it. So the bottom line is he and his family were the primary benefactors for this multi-million dollar chapel in Corpus Christi, Texas. I didn't do much to have that happen. I just gave the guy a miraculous medal and the Virgin Mary took care of the rest. I have a few other stories that I don't have time to share with you, but all I can tell you is that a lot of the work that I do is fruitful because I give out this medal and let Mary do all the heavy lifting. I used to ride on airplanes 30, 25 years ago and it, I didn't really like sitting next to some people because they always were bringing up stuff that was almost insoluble. Now I love sitting by these people because I listen to their problem. I say, yeah, that's okay. Got it. Got it. They say, hey, I'm going to give you my trademark. I give them the miraculous medal, tell them the little story about how Our Lady works with this medal, ask, encourage them to ask the Virgin Mary to pray with them directly to Jesus. And I just let Our Lady take care of their problems. I might say a few things, but I, I just stay relaxed. I'm not the one that's going to make it happen. It's the power of the Virgin Mary's prayer that's going to make it happen. And if you get that connection, if that goes deep into your mind today, you will learn how to give out the miraculous medal. And if you watch the video, you'll find a method that's very friendly, very low key. People like getting the medal because I use a series of questions to present the medal so they don't feel like I'm just dumping a lot of information on them. In this little exercise today, I've been going pretty fast but I know you're already predisposed to the middle. I know you already know half of what I'm saying, but the missing part for some of you might be that you don't fully understand why so many miracles and conversions happen when this medal is given to somebody. And so um, I'm very grateful to be able to share this with you because I have great confidence in all of you. And, you know, you were chosen by the Virgin Mary to, you probably were saying, I don't know if I want to zoom in today, but you said, okay, I'll zoom in. And because you zoomed in, our lady has zoomed in deeper into your life. And she's got some plans for you. I know you're from around the country, all over the country. So, you know, this is the way to plant the seeds. This is the way, one of the ways to work on the Virgin Mary's team. It's actually a lot of fun. <laughs> if, I, if I could have more time to tell you some of the amazing stories but i actually once had a woman who was miraculously healed she had a severe head injury she was in the hospital her head was one and a half times the size of normal i'd given a woman a medal that day the woman with the medal that i gave to her went to the hospital to see her friend 
The doctors said the woman was going to die. They couldn't do any more for her. My, my friend pinned the medal to her pillow, said a little prayer, left. The next day she comes back thinking her friend's going to be dead. Her, her friend who had been in a coma now was sitting up in the bed laughing and talking and they're bringing her food. And the way I found out about this, this happened in a town a thousand miles from where I live. A year after giving the woman the medal, I came back to that town and the woman came up to me and said, do you know what happened to that medal that you gave me a year ago? And then she told me the story. So this is, this is the kind of work Our Lady wants to do for us. This is the kind of love she has for us. And so I really hope that, um, that you'll be able to you know, get comfortable obtain, obtaining the medals and then practice giving the medal. If you watch the video three or four times, you can adapt it to your own style and you can find a way that works for you. And it's gonna be great. That's awesome. So, you, yeah. Yeah. We've, we've known, like I said, Father Jim, for, for several years, I've gotten a medal from, because he stands, he always has them in his pocket. <laughs> and, <laughs> you know, do you have a miraculous medal? You know, and, and, and passing them out. So, and like he said, and if you've already got one, you know, the people that you give them to can also share them with others. So we wanna spread this program um to others that we know people in our prayer groups uh the more and more of us reaching out any way we can to save souls the better yeah and just a practical thing you know a lot of people have either some family members or friends that aren't practicing their faith right so once you watch the video a number of times you can give this medal to one of those persons in a very friendly easy way that doesn't make them uncomfortable and if in if they just accept the medal, I've come to understand they are making a small act of faith. You know, you, you hand them the medal, they open their hand, they take it. That's like a small act of faith right there. And if they put it in their pocket, it's a small act of faith. And Our Lady goes to work. So have a lot of confidence in Our Lady and have a little bit of fun as you give out her miraculous medal. Thank so, you. yeah, should I give everybody a blessing? Please do. Wonderful. Yes, Father. Okay, so, Lord Jesus, we thank you for bringing us all together today. We thank you for the generosity of Dave and Joan and all the viewers. Lord, we ask you to pour your Holy Spirit upon them to guide them as they serve you and as they work to evangelize the world through the power of the Holy Spirit and through the intercession of Our Lady. And may Almighty God bless each one of you, the Father and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 I, I have a, a, just one quick question before you go, Father. Um, sure. In the, in the instructions, we have to send you an email, to, to you know, send our contact information to you. How do you use that? Is that just to keep in contact with everybody? Or yeah, yeah, what I do is I'm only sending out an update once a month because I don't want to burden people. And in the update, I usually just tell a few stories about new members of the Knights and Ladies and uh, maybe tell something beautiful that happened, you know, when someone gave a medal. Um, and other than that, I'm not, and the only reason I want their physical address is they can just put their city and state. I just want to know where they're from, you know, I mean, what state they're in. But we're not giving anybody emails or in. And I'm not calling people on the phone, but, uh, you know, if they emailed me and wanted me to call them on the phone, then I'd have their number. You know what I mean? It's just, mm -hmm. yeah, I'm not, it's, there's not much happening with, with that. Right. But right. Um, yeah, it, so it's, it, good. it's good. And then that way uh, people can share their stories, you know, and that yeah. inspires. There's a way to communicate. Fabulous. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Joan. Wow. Father Jim's email again, please, one more time. Can we I'm do sorry. what? Father Jim's email, so we could send it to the oh, right. Oh, team. yeah, yeah. Okay, it's the word Padre, P-A-D-R-E, and then three letters. J is in James, M is in Michael, K is in Kelleher. Okay. And then, so it's Mary Padre Mary. JMK at yahoo.com. And you just need the name? The address, maybe a phone number or yeah, and your email address because then I can send you updates. Yeah. Okay. That's all we Thank need. You. Thank you, Father.
Thank you. Are you where are you from? I'm from Carmel, Indiana. I've All been right. a, I've been a devotee of uh, Miraculous Medal. I've uh, done a couple of stuff. So I belong to the Team Mary. In fact, yes. I'm, I'm doing a coast to coast rosary on October the 10th. I'm leading that in Indianapolis. Awesome. But I've been wanting to join this group until Mary said, "You better go now." <laughs> Enough with excuses. Enough with excuses. There are 17 things you need to do but you know what the priority should be. And that's what I did. Amen. That's great. Well, All God right. bless you. Now, now you have 76. And also we have a, a, a text from Louise and then we'll, we'll get to uh, the Holy Hour in just a second. We all, she's a regular on our, uh, in our Novena Father. But she said her tablet isn't working, but her daughter is in labor. We've all known this. She was being induced today. Okay. She's nine centimeters ready to give birth. She said, I'm definitely ordering 100 medals and I'm going to give them out. Thank you, Paul. So, Beautiful. And that little baby's going to get one of those medals. Amen. <laughs> I'm here, Father. I'm Louise. Okay, Louise. I That's beautiful. You, if you could see, can you see me, Jim? No, uh, we just see your name. Yeah, I, I just see your yeah, name right I, now, I don't Louise. Know, but I'm here behind the veil. <laughs> She's You're behind great. the veil. Yeah. <laughs> Wonderful. You're behind Mary's veil. Yes, absolutely. I'm so excited. I feel like this is my new mission. Wonderful. I'm, I'm, I'm going to start with 100 and then I'll be up to five in about a week. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, it's just so beautiful. And it's really amazing how the Virgin Mary will send people directly to you that she wants you to give this medal to and you'll actually get the sense of it. You know, Amen. You'll, be, you'll say, why am I talking to this person? And you go, oh, Maybe Our Lady wants me to give them the medal. Definitely, I'm excited. Well, Father, yeah. give us give us an opportunity to, to to do this as we can, and we'll have you back in another month or two, and uh, to share. It'd stories. be fun, you know. It'd be fun to see how it's growing, and okay. it's so simple, it's so joyful, you know. And, and we need that. We all we're all desiring that joy of Our Lady and of Jesus, right? All so. part of the triumph. God bless you, Father. We love all right. You. God bless all of you. Love you Father. Thank I you just, so much. I just got a text. She just had the baby. Oh, Amen. all right. Praise so, God. Amen. Praise God. All right. Well, God bless all you right. all. Thank all right. you again. Father. All right. Bye bye. No, I'm still here. You're here. I'll Father's got to go. Father's got to okay, go. Bye. Yes. All right. Well, what great joy. Um, we welcome this new child into the world, Louise's grandbaby. Pray for her daughter and uh, to heal up well and for the baby to grow in strength and wisdom and God's love and joy. Now we can say we had a baby on our Zoom meeting today. <laughs> <laughs> I just wish I could, I don't know why, I could see you guys perfectly, but it's blocked on my end, my little box. So I don't know. But all right. Well, let's. Um, we should get to Vilnius and yes. uh, get to the I'm Lord. So, so I'm so excited. God love us. Yeah. Looks like we might have some uh, new folks with us. Thank you for You're welcome for joining. Yes, Rachel, Rachel, we see you there. Hi. Oh, we can't hear you. Uh, you're muted. You so you need to unmute. Oh, I, I must have got in late because of the time change. Oh, what time okay. is it? I mean, it depends. I'm in Chicago. Chicago. You're in Chicago. It's 411 right now in central time. So we start about the, the holy hour starts usually right at, at five o'clock Eastern, four o'clock central and so forth. Then we meet for about 20 minutes before ahead of time and have a guest speaker. Father Kelleher went a little bit over today, but so um, we start at 3.30 Central. Right. Okay. So yeah. help me help understand Father Kelleher. It's not the same Father Kelleher that used to do the rosary and everything and travel. Yes. 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 <gasps> yes. Seriously. Do oh, my goodness. Rosary, Father Kelleher. He, do right. the, he did it at the Rose Bowl in the stadium yeah. and uh, in Ireland and all over in lombard illinois yeah probably, probably so he's been doing it for a long long time so he yes a global living and i've been with him oh well <laughs> many many years ago and a friend of mine i we i just got 
Jot down doing um, Christ Renews His Parish weekend chirp with our group, and we had 28 um, team members. Wow. Awesome. And it was, it was awesome. And one of my dearest, dearest friends who, um, who spoke also had um, turned to um, prayer and found Father Kelleher at, and she looked for strength in, in her journey and found him many years ago. Um, yeah. It's a blessing. And I met you too at Visitation Church in Elmhurst, Illinois. Oh, yeah. For the Divine Mercy and the Shroud of Turin. Right, right. And well, so it's well, good to see you again. You you see so many people, so you you know. But well, we're glad you joined us. Yeah, thank you. It was a blessing. Yeah. Uh, and if so, you know, if you are uh, new if, with uh, Zoom, uh, you can click on the chat, and the, the very uh, first uh, item in the chat today is the Knight's Miraculous Medal. Uh, website from from Father Jim, and also the, the the next one is the store where you can buy those miraculous medals. And also, if you're new, when we get to the prayer part, the responses it doesn't work in Zoom. If everybody responds, Holy Mary, Mother of God, it it breaks up between trying to find. So normally we all have our our microphone on mute, and whoever's leading, you know, we can. Uh, we can vocally respond, but our microphone's on mute, but that's just how we how we pray here uh, on Zoom. Does that make sense? Yes. So yes. we're kind of tardy getting over to, to Vilnius. We should well, probably- Let's fly over there. Shall we? And we will- end. Now, also, this is, and we'll, oh, let's see, what did I do? There it is, yes. We'll pause just for a moment as we, we place ourselves in the presence of the living Son, of the living God, in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Dear Jesus, we adore you. We praise you, Lord Jesus, your goodness, your mercy. Pour out upon the world. And, oh, your mother, Lord Jesus, we love your mother, our blessed mother, beautiful queen of heaven, queen of earth, queen of the rosary, queen of our families, queen of our lives. We ask you, dear Blessed Mother, to intercede for us, to give us all the graces, abundant, abundant graces uh, for us, for our families, especially our family members. You know, dear Blessed Mother, how much uh, we love and we, we're concerned about our family members that are away from your son. So we ask for great graces and we believe in the virgin birth of the Son of God, we believe, Jesus, that you are with us, body, blood, soul, and divinity in the monstrance. And if, if, uh, if you're new to this, this is the chapel in Lithuania, and above the tabernacle there is the original painting, <coughs> not a print, but the, the original painting of the Divine Mercy done in 1934 under the direction of St. Faustina and Blessed Father Michael Sapochko. And uh, there's a longer story as to why that's in Vilnius, Lithuania today, but we won't go into that today. And uh, just know that's the original painting of the Divine Mercy. As we're joined here today to make this holy hour, because the Lord told St. Faustina to spend an hour in adoration for nine days on behalf of her country, so we're doing this together virtually. And he also told her to receive Holy Communion. Another time he told her to receive Holy Communion for nine days. And so during this holy hour, um, we will make a spiritual communion in lieu, in lieu of that as the next best thing. So we'll put that on the screen and unite ourselves spiritually with the true presence of Jesus. As I navigate moment, to it, yes. Thank you for your patience. There we go. And so we pray, my Jesus, I, I believe, believe that you are present in the most blessed sacrament. sacrament. I, I love, love you above all things, and I, I desire to receive you into my soul. 
since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you are already there and unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. And we begin the Holy Hour, this time of prayer together, with the recitation of the Holy Rosary. Exciting to do so at this month of October, the month of the Holy Rosary, and the day before Our Lady's Feast of the Holy Rosary, Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, and Our Lady of Victory, <clears throat> reminding us of the power of her prayer and her intercession is Father Jim has told us through the rosary, through her medals, through our love and devotion. And so in Vilnius, it's 18 minutes past midnight on uh, October 7th. Oh. So they are ushering in the feast. We pray the rosary in the name of the Father and the and Son. Of the Son and of the, the Holy, Holy Spirit. Spirit. Amen. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, and was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, life everlasting. Amen. And for our Holy Father, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. For an increase in faith, hope, and charity. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is, is now, now, and, and ever shall be, world, world without, without end. end. Amen. Amen. And in, in, the, in the chat suggested, so how about, it's probably on everyone's heart, we'll dedicate this rosary to the newborn child. You want to announce the mystery? Yes. And then uh, Angie's doing the first decade. And <clears throat> we're doing the glorious mysteries today. The first glorious mystery is the resurrection. Fruit of the mystery is faith. Do we lead the first part? Go ahead, Angie. Do the whole decade. Did we lose her? Angie? Are you there, Angie? You need to unmute, sweetheart. Sorry. There she is. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, <clears throat> full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need of thy mercy. The second glorious mystery is the ascension of our Lord Jesus into heaven. Fruit of the mystery is hope. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those that are in most need of thy mercy. And the third glorious mystery is the descent of the Holy Spirit. Fruit of the mystery is charity. Okay, Rita. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, mother of God, Pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. You keep walking this. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my children, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls into heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Thank you, Rita. The fourth glorious mystery, the Dormition, the Assumption of our Blessed Virgin, of our Blessed Mother, the Virgin Mother of Jesus, into heaven. Fruit of the mystery oh. Union with Christ. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread 
and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Thank you, Flavia. The fifth glorious mystery. The coronation, our blessed mother, is crowned queen of heaven and earth. Fruit of the mystery is union with thee, O Immaculate One. Ada, are you there? Ooh. Apparently she had gotten bumped off. She's coming back in now. see you now Otto. There yeah you I lost I lost the whole thing I had to restart reopen again am I okay can I do the yes. visit yes you're good fifth fifth okay, did you already announce it yes. yes okay our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary. And I want to offer this decade for all our families and all of those who may be carrying a cross of some kind, so that they, we all receive the necessary graces to earn a crown of glory in heaven. And, Hail and Mary. Ada, I, Ada, if you want to do the uh, flame of love, you can do that. that oh, okay. Okay. Thank you. Thanks. Um, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all humanity now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Come, Holy Spirit, come by means of the power of the flame of love of the Immaculate Heart of Mary. Thank you, Ada. Hail, Hail Holy, Holy Queen, Queen Mother, Mother of Mercy. mercy. Our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, thine eyes of mercy towards us. And after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. And let us pray. O God, God whose only begotten, begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, 
has purchased for us the rewards of eternal salvation. Grant, we beseech thee, that by meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary, of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise. Through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. St. Michael the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and the snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the heavenly hosts, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who prowl about the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Sacred Heart of Jesus, have mercy on us. Immaculate Heart of Mary, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Saint Faustina, pray for us. Saint Bruno, pray, pray for, for us. us. And now we will follow the Rosary up with the uh, prayer of Pope Leo the Thirteenth, uh, the prayer to Saint Joseph, to be recited at the end of the Holy Rosary. To you, O blessed Joseph, do we come in our tribulation, and having implored the help of your most holy spouse, we confidently invoke your patronage also. Through that charity which bound you to the Immaculate Virgin, Mother of God, and through the paternal love with which you embraced the child Jesus, we humbly beg you graciously to regard the inheritance which Jesus Christ has purchased by his blood and with your power and strength to aid us in our necessities. O most watchful guardian of the Holy Family, defend the chosen children of Jesus Christ. O most loving Father, ward off from us every contagion of error and corrupting influence. O our most mighty protector, be kind to us, and from heaven assist us in our struggle with the power of darkness. As once you rescued the child Jesus from deadly peril, so now protect God's holy church from the snares of the enemy and from all adversity. Shield, too, each one of us by your constant protection, so that, supported by your example and your aid, we may be able to live piously, to die in holiness, and to obtain eternal happiness in heaven. Amen. Amen. That was very nice. Yeah, thank, thank you, Rachel. We'll move on now to the recitation of the Litany of the Saints. And why? As most of you know, because the Lord told us, told St. Faustina, to reach out to the Church Triumphant, reach out to the Saints, to pray the Litany of Saints for her country. To pray a novena of a the novena. litany of the saints right. for her country. Right. So together uh, we'll pray, Dave, and I will lead this. In the name of the Father, and the and Son, the Son, and, and of the Holy, Holy Spirit. Spirit. Amen. Amen. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, hear us. Christ, graciously hear us. God, the Father of heaven. Have mercy on us. God, the Son, Redeemer of the world. Have mercy on us. God, the Holy Spirit. Have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God. Have mercy on us. Holy Mary, pray for us. Holy Mother of God, pray for us. Holy Virgin of Virgins, pray for us. Saint Michael, pray for us. Saint Gabriel, pray for us. Saint Raphael, pray for us. All you holy angels and archangels, pray for us. Saint John the Baptist, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. All you holy patriarchs and prophets, pray for us. 
Saint Peter, pray for us. Saint Paul, pray for us. Saint Andrew, pray for us. Saint James, pray for us. Saint John, pray for us. Saint Thomas, pray for us. Saint James, pray for us. Saint Philip, pray for us. Saint Bartholomew, pray for us. Saint Matthew, pray for us. Saint Simon, pray for us. Saint Jude, pray for us. Saint Matthias, Pray for us. Saint Barnabas. Pray for us. Saint Luke. Pray for Saint us. Saint Mark. Pray for us. All you holy apostles and evangelists. Pray for us. All you holy disciples of the Lord. Pray for us. All you holy innocents. Pray for us. Saint Stephen. Pray for us. Saint Lawrence. Pray for us. Saint Vincent. Pray for us. Saints Fabian and Sebastian. Pray for us. Saints John and Paul. Pray for us. Saints Cosmos and Damien. Pray for us. All you holy martyrs. Pray for us. Saint Sylvester. Pray for us. Saint Gregory. Pray for us. Saint Ambrose. Pray for us. Saint Augustine. Pray for us. Saint Jerome. Pray for us. Saint Martin. Pray for us. Saint Nicholas. Pray for us. Saint Bruno. Pray for us. All you holy bishops and confessors. Pray for us. All you holy doctors. Pray for us. Saint Anthony. Pray for us. Saint Benedict. Pray for us. Saint Bernard. Pray for us. Saint Dominic. Pray for us. Saint Francis. Pray for us. Saint Pio. Pray for us. All you holy priests and Levites. Pray for us. All you holy monks and hermits. Pray for us. Saint Mary Magdalene. Pray for us. Saint Agatha. Pray for us. Saint Lucy. Pray for us. Saint Agnes. Pray for us. Saint Cecilia. Pray for us. Saint Anastasia. Pray for us. Saint Catherine. Pray for us. Saint Claire. Pray for us. Saint Elizabeth. Pray for us. Saint Faustina. Pray for us. All you holy virgins and widows. Pray for us. All you holy saints of God. Pray for us. Lord, be merciful. Lord, save your people. From all evil. Lord, save your people. From all sin. Lord, save your people. From your wrath. Lord, save your people. From a sudden and unprovided death. Lord, save your people. From the snares of the devil. Lord, save your people. From anger, hatred, and all ill will. Lord, save your people. From the spirit of uncleanness. Lord, save your people. From lightning and tempest. Lord, save your people. From the scourge of earthquake. Lord, save your people. From anger, hatred, and all ill will. Lord, save your people. From plague, famine, and war. Lord, save your people. From everlasting death. Lord, save your people. By the mystery of your holy incarnation. Lord, save your people. By your coming. Lord, save your people. By your birth. Lord, save your people. By your baptism and holy fasting. Lord, save your people. By your cross and passion. Lord, save your people. By your death and burial. Lord, save your people. By your holy resurrection. Lord, save your people. By your wonderful ascension. Lord, save your people. By the coming of the Holy Spirit. Lord, save your people. On the day of judgment. Lord, save your people. Be merciful to us sinners. Lord, hear our prayer. That you will spare us. Lord, hear our prayer. That you will pardon us. Lord, hear our prayer. That it may please you to bring us to true penance. Lord, hear our prayer. Guide and protect your holy church. Lord, hear our prayer. Preserve in holy religion the Pope and all those in holy orders. Lord, hear our prayer. Humble the enemies of holy church. Lord, hear our prayer. Give peace and unity to the whole Christian people. Lord, hear our prayer. Bring back to the unity of the church all those who are straying and bring all unbelievers to the light of the gospel. Lord, hear our prayer. Strengthen and preserve us in your holy service. Lord, hear our prayer. Raise our minds to desire the things of heaven. Lord, hear our prayer. Reward all our benefactors with eternal blessings. Lord, hear our prayer. Deliver our souls from eternal damnation and the souls of our brethren, relatives, and benefactors. Lord, hear our prayer. 
Give and preserve the fruits of the earth. Lord, hear our prayer. Grant eternal rest to all the faithful departed. Lord, hear our prayer. That it may please you to hear and heed us, Jesus, Son of the living God. Lord, hear our prayer. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Spare us, O Lord. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Graciously hear us, O Lord. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Christ, hear us. Christ, graciously hear us. Lord Jesus, hear our prayer. Lord Jesus, hear our prayer. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. The uh, Litany of the Saints, we'll pray the chaplet here in just a second, but is available on the divinemercyforamerica.org website on the resource page. You can print it out, download it, and print it out. But we also have them available on our website as a prayer card, and they're very durable. Um, people p get these and put them in chapels and the back of the church or distribute to your prayer group. So, alrighty, so we will conclude this time of prayer together, as we normally do, by reciting the beautiful, the most powerful chaplet of the Divine Mercy. Because Jesus asked Saint Faustina to pray it with the sisters and the Lord and the wards, the young women that they took care of, that they were hoping and helping to rehabilitate. <clears throat> we lift up especially today all the uh, sick and the suffering. We have had some prayer intentions for people that are that are ill, and there are many ill. There are many many ills. Many 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 things that are plaguing our society right now, dear Lord Jesus. But you are the God of mercy. You are doctor of doctors. You are the healer of healers. You love us. You suffered for us. You died for us. You, it is because of you that we are here today to adore you, to glorify you, to thank you, and to intercede together on behalf of our brothers and sisters, Lord Jesus. We pray for the blessing of St. Pope John Paul II, who extended an apostolic blessing on all of us that during adoration, that we pray the chaplet of mercy for the sick and the dying, dying, and in particular, in particular for those that are unprepared for death. Thank you for this gift. We thank you for your mercy. And we, in all humility, thank you for allowing us to offer this prayer to our Heavenly Father. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. The optional opening prayer. You expired, Jesus, but the source of life gushed forth for souls, and the ocean of mercy opened up for the whole world. O fount of life, unfathomable divine mercy, Envelop the whole world and empty yourself out upon us. O, o blood, blood and, and water, water which, which gush forth from the heart of Jesus, as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. O blood and water, which gush forth from the heart of Jesus, as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. O blood and water, which gush forth from the heart of Jesus, as a fount of mercy for us. I trust in you. And uh, before we get to Irene, it came to me as we were praying this blood and water prayer. Most of you probably know that this prayer, Jesus said when we pray it, the blood and water prayer, with a contrite heart on behalf of some sinner, he will grant them the grace of conversion. So we call to mind as we we're praying, especially with the news of the new baby, Louise's, new grandbaby that was just born minutes ago. Pray for the conversion of those that would, that would take innocent lives from the wombs of their mothers, and especially those that, especially recently, that voted that this should be a right up to nine months 
and we pray that their eyes will be open to the the great sin of this the tragedy of this the evilness of this that they will repent and that they will heal and they will be converted and reconciled to you lord and become great champions for the defense of the unborn and all the weak and we thank you ahead of time jesus for hearing and answering our prayer our father who art in heaven it's irene is Oh, I'm sorry. Irene. She's doing the intro yes. prayers. Okay. Sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. We didn't do the intro. So we'll do the intro prayers and then Irene. The decade. The, excuse me. The first decade. Sorry about that. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. And from there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body and life everlasting. Amen. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer you the body, blood, soul, and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer thee the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Do I have one more? I don't know. Her, her. I think uh, okay. that's it. Okay. Celeste, I think we muted you Sorry. by mistake. Yes. Are you there? Yes, she is. 
unmute. Sorry. Okay. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer thee the body and blood, soul and divinity of thy dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Okay, Christine, are you there? Did we lose her? There she is. Christine, you need to unmute. There you go. There you go. Okay, I thought I was, I'm sorry. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, holy mighty one, holy immortal one, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, holy mighty one, holy immortal one, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, holy mighty one, holy immortal one, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal God in whom mercy is endless and the treasury of compassion inexhaustible, look kindly upon us and increase your mercy in us that in difficult moments we might not despair nor become despondent, but with great confidence submit ourselves to your holy will, which is love and mercy itself, amen. Thank you, everybody.
We pray in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Tum ego sacramentum venerem ocenui et anticum documentum no voce da ritui prestet fides supplementum Sensum defectui, genitori, genitoque, lauset jubilatio, salus honor virtus quoque, sit et benedictio. Procedenti abutroque, comparsit laudatio. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. We love you, Lord. Praise you, Jesus. Well, everybody, thank you for praying with us, being joined together from coast to coast, north, south, east, west, and beyond. And not only for those of you that are joining us here live, but those that tune in on YouTube. Uh, Rachel, you had said earlier that you came in a little late. Well, we'll be posting this on YouTube, on the yep. Divine Mercy for America YouTube yep. channel. And usually once we finish, it takes a couple hours to get it uploaded, but you'll be able to look. And if you want to catch the beginning of Father Jim's talk or his little training lesson that he gave everybody today, and he was going through it quite quickly. If you need a refresher course, uh, you'll be able to, to catch it on the YouTube channel. And the link to the YouTube channel is in the email we send out for the reminder that with the zoom link and everything it's underneath that it says in the text you know it's on the has the link in there and also the link is in the chat and we'll put that in the uh the youtube description once we uploaded the nights it's nights miraculous metal dot com m-e-d-a-l m-e-d-a-l yeah. nights k-n-i-g-h-t-s yes, yes. nights miraculous metal dot com is Father Jim's website. What How about Father Jim? Is <laughs> something Boy, else. I don't think much moss grows, you know, <laughs> on that rolling stone. No. And I have a quick story I'd like to share, a, a miraculous metal story. Some of you may or may not be aware oh. of this, of how powerful it works. Um, there was a woman, I believe it was in New Jersey, or, uh, not New Jersey, New Hampshire, or maybe Vermont. I, I get them mix up. One of those two states. And there was a, a man who was working at a kiosk um, in the mall, at a jewelry store kiosk in the mall. And there was a woman who um, came to buy some, she was shopping with her daughter, and she stopped at the kiosk and to buy a pair of earrings. And she said, these earrings are always at my bedside every night. I wear the same earrings, but this morning I woke up and they were missing or one of the pair was missing, some, something strange like that. So she thought, I'll, I'll buy a pair. And she told the man that uh, she was going to continue shopping with her daughter and she would come back later to pick them up. I guess they were expensive. I don't know. But anyway, when she went back, she was one of these uh, people that her had a ministry of distributing miraculous medals. And she felt that the man that was helping her, uh, that she should offer him the miraculous medal. So they did their business transaction and 
before they finished, she said, now I have something for you. And he said, oh, you do. And she said, yes, and it's very powerful. And so the man put his hand out and she put it in his hand. Of course, it was the miraculous metal. Now, what she didn't know is the man who was working at the kiosk had been a high wizard in the church of Satan for many, many years. His name is Zachary King. And he had after like, I don't know, was it 17 years as I, many, many years in it over time, he, he, you can look up his story, but he had become, he, he was get, kind of getting out of it. You know, I kind of worn out. He had done all these terrible things. And, um, uh, so he, he, he was on his way out, but he had still had this background and experience and there's only in any time in the world, two or three high wizards in the whole world. All right. So he was very high up. So of course, when he, t when she told him, I'm going to give you something very powerful. He thought, Oh, I'll be able to tell if it's powerful or not. Right. Because he had this, I don't want to use the word gift, but, um, what he thought was a gift. So he closes his hand on the miraculous metal and he didn't know what it was at the time. He goes, some disc. And he said that all of a sudden, he saw this beautiful woman standing in front of him. He goes, everything else stopped. And she basically said, I want you to meet someone. I want you to meet my son. And she turned him around. I believe the story goes. And there was the divine mercy. You know, all he saw this in his mind bef before him. And he underwent, just as father kind of was sharing in his soul and his mind, that this was God, that this was truly God. And so he started speaking to the woman of this. Well, we know that this to be a true story because the woman also worked in Richard's Vineyards retreats, the post abortive women. And she was friends with Father Anthony Gramlich. Father Anthony Gramlich is the rector at the shrine of the Divine Mercy in Stockbridge, Massachusetts. So she said, I need to take you to the shrine. And we heard this story both from Zach and, but also from Father Anthony who confirmed it. And he goes, and one day he got a call from this lady saying, I have someone that I want you to meet, to bring to you to the shrine of divine mercy. He's a former Satanist. And Father Anthony was like, no, I'm not an exorcist. I don't know how to deal with this stuff. You know, I, I don't know that I'm the man, you know, I'm not the priest. You need to find somebody else. But she said, Father, you're at the shrine of the divine mercy. I don't have anybody place else to bring him. So he said, okay, bring him. And Father Anthony met um, Zach King and took him through classes and gave him instruction. And Zach eventually um, joined the repented of everything, became a, a, a Catholic, joined the Catholic Church. He, we met him, he was speaking at a conference and that's what we saw at the conference. It was one out in Oakland. And we saw in the, the, the lineup, this Zach King, former Satanist, and we were all, did you We have... didn't know him at the time, you know, we'd, we'd never heard of him. And, and so we're, uh, we're thinking, who is, you know, I wonder who, wow, that's inter interesting. I wonder who that is. So. Uh, at uh getting coffee you know before we're gonna we're at the hotel and we're gonna go over to the conference and uh, here comes father uh, anthony of course we know father anthony gramlich for you know years and this but we said father anthony do you, do you know anything about this zach king that the former saint and he goes yes i'm his spiritual director we said, oh, we said okay okay so, Tell us. so he told us you know the story and uh, a brief version of the story we you know we heard the longer version later and uh and you can find him online zachary king yeah maybe we'll have him um Ooh. on the show he's you been should have him. you should have him there we had him at our lady center a couple you... of years ago okay yeah we've told the story at our lady center i i know and uh and i would tell you it's it's it, um he is so prayerful, so dev devoted to the Holy Eucharist, confession. He mm -hmm. gives talks. Hmm? Rachel wants to say. After yes, your, Rachel. Yeah. Uh, he, he gives talks about how, how the Church of Satan goes after especially young people and children and, and how they get roped in. And a big part of his message too is on the sin of abortion 
and how this is a satanic sacrifice. And he goes, and it's legal in our country. And mm -hmm. on and on and on. And he connects the dots very, very beautifully. So, but it was because that woman, we don't want to forget the point, all she did was followed her inspiration, the prompting of the Holy Spirit to plop that medal in his hand and Our Lady did the rest. Yes, Rachel. Okay, this is um, the, the um, cross of St. Benedict. Yes. And the, this is the cross that they, the exorcists use. And they, but they're giant sized. Yeah. They're giant sized. So it's the cross of St. Benedict. And this yes. is the, the exorcist right. cross. Right. So I, I wear it, I give it to my family. Um, we're That's in a strange thing. world. We need yeah. this. So, yeah. and they have, they have rosaries too. I just got a new one this week. Yeah. Um, this weekend, but mm -hmm. I do have to go. I will see you again. All right. When's the last time you're on? Tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow. Okay. We, we do the... this the first through the ninth every month. Okay. The, for, the, the first nine days? The ninth. Okay. Uh, for the nine mm -hmm. days of the novena. Right. Hope okay. to see you tomorrow. Okay. All right. Thank you. God bless you. Bye. Thanks for joining God bless you. Does anybody else have any other questions or comments? Do you want I have to a I have a miraculous metal story about Mother Teresa. Yeah. Have you have you heard of the one where um, she wanted to go to Nicaragua when um, Noriega was in power and open up one of her houses of charity, and um, had no idea of how she was going to do it, but providentially, miraculously, she and um, the priest were able to get an audience with him. So they come to his office and um, he's in a state already. And um, he starts on a rant against the, U the U.S. and um, President Reagan for 20 minutes. So she and the priest listened to that for 20 minutes and at the end of it all, he stops and she goes, and how's your family? And um, she asks about how many children he, he had. And um, at the end of it all, she gives him a miraculous medal for him and each one of the family members. And within two weeks, they got permission to open up a house there. Beautiful. Thanks, Irene. <laughs> These things work. <laughs> How about that? Heaven has given us so many different avenues. And I think it's, you know, how they say you will be fishers of men. Again, it's like having the tackle box with all different kinds of lures uh, for big fish, little fish, you know, depending on wherever they're swimming, there's lots of different ways to reach out. The image of the divine mercy, of course, is another one of my favorites. But, mm -hmm. um, you know, just do what, use what God has put on your heart. Anybody else? Thank you, Joan. And thank you, Joan. It's Louise again. Thank okay. you for praying for us. We're so excited. We I are... think I wasn't meant to be seen today because my phone was like going off the hook and yeah. I was I was in and out of prayer. Yeah. Excitement got... and just thank you. You got a lot going on. God bless you, Louise. We'll look forward to seeing pictures of that baby. <laughs> yes. Lord willing, I'll, I'll see you tomorrow. Praise God. Thank you. Because my aid's walking and I got to go. Love okay. you guys. Love you too. Thank you. Thank you. And there's Terry on the beach. <laughs> Are you muted, Terry? Sorry. I'm, I'm just in my backyard. Oh, you're in your back. Oh, it looks oh. like the beach. It's a, it's a block wall behind me. It's not sand. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> we, just got, we got home just... Um, um, just before this started so we we got our stuff put away and oh. well kind of and then i saw what time it was so i just hopped on on my phone i just sat out here so oh. um, very quickly um the priest yesterday at, at my mom's funeral he's um an, he's a new priest he's 45 and he's only been a priest for four years but um he is devoted to the divine mercy and he because yesterday was the feast of saint Faustina, and he um called me up and he gave me for my family 
he blessed, um, I think about 25, eight by 10 pictures of the divine mercy and um, asked me to pass them out to the, you know, my extended family who was there. Um, so that was really nice. That was, he called me up after the homily during my mom's funeral mass Wow. and, and did that. And then um, between the decades of the rosary and also at the very end when he was blessing and sensing my mom's casket, um, the two people who were singing, who were good friends of my mom, he had, he asked them to sing the Adoramus Day from Annie Cartel, the one that she sings. Oh, yes, yes. So just, it was just so nice. I mean, it was very, very wow. special. So Beautiful. Those are two just amazing things yesterday, you know, so. God is good. Great. That was very, very good. So that's it. Thank and we you, want to Karen. say hi to Vincente for and uh, thanks for joining us uh, yes, today. Well. I believe it's your first time, so thank you for joining us. Come back anytime. <laughs> and his wife too, I think, is there. Oh, you're on mute if you're trying to speak, Vincente. Sorry, I was gonna give you a thirty-second story since you brought me up. Sure. My wife sure. has been a proponent of miraculous medals for umpteen years. So we, she would list out maybe 10, 20, 30 different uh, relatives and uh, she would give out these miraculous medals. And we've been, as I mentioned earlier, we're part of the Mary's team. And I'm just glad I joined this list for the first time. And I hope to do that uh, tomorrow and the following uh, events whenever that happens. But just to clarify, is this novena the monthly nine-day novena as opposed to the uh, novi days. novena for the nation because see that's the 54-day novena mm -hmm. are these different things mm -hmm. yes this this is uh this is a different one you know so we've got really two novenas from our point of view we have two novenas that we're we're sending out and involved in at this point so the 54-day novena that ends tomorrow uh the yes. one we're yes one we're doing is doing that so well thank you thank you for uh you're welcome getting us participating in the in the so this is a, a a novena that we do every month uh from the first to through the ninth and we do the novenas that uh jesus and our lady asked saint faustina to do now uh they didn't ask her to do it from the first to the ninth that's just something we came up with to do it you know we figure we do them every month from the first to the ninth and and uh, that'll be that so but these novenas were asked uh, for St. Faustina uh, to do for Poland, specifically for her country of Poland. So we do that and apply it to our country and whoever's praying with us for their country and all over the world. So that's kind of how that works out. Yeah. We have a priest that, uh, since your first time, that joins us every month from India. And um, mm -hmm. he's spreading divine mercy there, translated the diary into his native language, and it's soon to be published wow. for 100 million people. Um, we have people from the Philippines, from Canada. Um, we've had people join us. Well, and then they tune in also on our YouTube channel when they can't be with us. Live. And we do a we do another 54 day Rosary Novena for our nation uh, from Ash Wednesday to uh, Divine Mercy Sunday. Turns out oh, that's okay. 50, 54 exactly days. 54 days. So, and during that novena, we'll also do the the first of the month novenas, and we'll do the. Uh, the Divine Mercy Novena that starts on Good Friday to uh, to the Vigil yeah. Mercy Sunday. So. Our Lady said, pray, pray, pray. Pray, pray, pray. <laughs> yes. It's working. It's, yes. it's working. It you is know, working. It's working. By God's and grace. it's working. Yes. It's, it, it's, it's a lot to pray for. Praise God. So we love you all so much and are so thankful that we are, have this opportunity to join together. All your smiling faces, your wonderful prayers, getting to know you. Um, we will be back tomorrow. The Feast of uh, Our Lady of the Holy Rosary. The Feast of I Like Our Lady of Victories. To remind of victory, us. Yes. Yeah, it's victory. Victory is ours. And we get to celebrate tomorrow. So it will be a joyous occasion. It's the 450th anniversary of victory of um, at Lepanto. Lepanto, Lepanto, however you say it. And you say Lepanto, I say Lepanto. <laughs> well, I'm right. <laughs> you should invite, uh, what's his name? Okay. Uh, it's born. It's born, yeah. Michael. <laughs> 
Michael Hitchborn, the Panther Institute. Yeah. Oh no, Michael that would have been that would have been. Oh yeah. We'll have to get him next time. Wow. Next year. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, thank you. Thank all right, you. everybody. Have a good evening. God bless you all. Stay Bye. safe. Thank you. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Dave and Joan signing off. Click Bye, in. Peter. Honey. <laughs>